Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to discuss about enabling logout timeout. Let's get started into the topic. So normally every user is associated with an access group. So if you go to Pega under security, you have access group. So here I'm selecting Zmart users. Once you selected this under advanced tab, here you can see authentication timeout. So we have to mention some time over here. If not, uh, it won't conserve this. So no timeout will be enforced if value is not specified. I'm having 100. So what is this 100 is? Suppose a user has logged in and for 100 seconds, the user didn't do any type of activity in that uh, browser and they just minimized. Then Pega will automatically detect that and it will enforce a logout pop-up like this session is about to logout. This is the time here you can see choose a time in seconds. So here you may have to mention time in seconds. Suppose if you want it for uh, 5 minutes. So 5 into 60, 300 you have to specify over here. This is the first place where we have to do the change. And second place is under sysadmin you can see authentication service. Under authentication service here if you have seen in the last video we have selected this open ID connect that is for our google uh, integration so for any uh, authentication service if you scroll below there is an advanced configuration tab open that and here there is something called as use access group timeout so when you specify this the users who uses this authentication service will automatically inherit the timeout from the access group that we have specified and if you want to do any uh, pre-authentication activity or post-authentication activity here you can specify in our authentication service this particular option is available in uh, all the authentication services like this open id this is basic uh, credentials for example and here also you can see this is enabled so you have to make sure that you have to specify value in access group and then you have to apply that particular timeout to your authentication service if you do these two changes uh, the logout uh, pop-up window will be appeared if a uh, respective user belongs to that access group didn't do any transaction kept browser idle for the specified time hope you have uh, learned a new topic thanks please watch subscribe and share to your colleagues